Good morning, Jerusalem. Never thought we'd get back here. There is the Dome of the Rock right behind. I can see the domes of the Holy Sepulchre there and the Mount of Olives in the distance. And there's the Church of St. Xavier, which is the Franciscan Church of Jerusalem. And we're off to Bethlehem today. So good morning, Jerusalem. Wonderful to be back. Here's the wall that surrounds the Bethlehem. The wall is ahead of us. Look at the wall. Look at the wall. This was the main entrance to Bethlehem, by the way. I mean, I know a lot. And I say these are qualified, these are not qualified. You know, some of those names are Muslim families, by the way. I don't know him, but Steve is a good source. And here we're Steve, going through the wall to into Bethlehem. We are in Israel, Israel now, but as soon as we get through here, we are Christian in Bethlehem. Around. So we're going in the Palestinian the West Bank. This is all one big complex here to run uh, the security of those who have permits to go out and work in Israel. They're inside the wall. Welcome to Bethlehem. So if you bought an activity scene at the night of uh, Holy Sepulchre's meeting, do you think it's authentic? Which one? Uh, at the Holy Sepulchre meeting. About to show you some of the items that we talked about. We talked about a quality olive wood carving, hand carved. Here's Our Lady of Nazareth, folks, right there. I mean, when I say one step forward and the statue can speak, that's what I mean by that. It's a very Mr. Steve and Ms. Janet, we are very honored and blessed to have you and to have your people. You've always been very helpful to the Christian Catholic community in Bethlehem. Father Chas, Father Chas, right? I give you a small gift, a vestment that was made by a Catholic nun who lives in Bethlehem with the Jerusalem cross, the typical cross of the Holy Land. comes one big cross. Yeah. Wow. And this is a gift for the Father Holy Chess. Family. This is a sterling silver. I cannot see him. <laughs> this is a sterling silver with gold plated. The reason we are doing that, you represent Father with the people and Mr. Steve and Janet in the Holy Land, especially in Bethlehem. It's not only selling, but it gives us as a Christian a lot of hope. Thank you for coming. Enjoy your shopping, and God is good. In the name of the Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you. 
Joy to the world. Joy to the world. The Lord is come. Let every receive our King. Let every heart bring every room. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and nature sing. And heaven and Merry Christmas! <laughs>
14-pointed star in the Grotto of Nativity marks the place where Jesus was born, and our folks got to touch that star and touch their rosaries. Here's Father Chaz laying there praying, and here he is at the place where the manger was placed. So we're in the nave now of the Church of Nativity, and of course the Greek Orthodox are in charge of all this, but here they've uncovered some of these beautiful mosaics from the probably 4th, 5th, 6th century, and they've uncovered recently these images of the saints on the pillars. So it looks so much different now than when we started coming here. Look at that. This is Amr explaining the church in the day. You need to understand that the Muslims, when they first arrived, they were very hard. We're now in the Roman Catholic Church of St. Catherine of Alexandria, attached to the Church of Nativity. Much cleaner and more sanity here. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Here's a good view of the Judean wilderness. It's clear today, looking out towards the east from Bethlehem. But we actually stopped here, gave everybody a break because we brought them to the Herodian. This was the huge man-made mountain and fortress of King Herod the Great, and they actually found his tomb in here, the only fortress named after him, the Herodium. So our folks were all taking a break looking at this, learning about it, and looking out over the Judean wilderness. So here we're at our restaurant. Hello, hello. I'll be right back, I gotta get a video. Here's our seats here. We're gonna have the dancers coming up here and uh, the musician's gonna be going here. And there's the bar. So all the tables with the blue napkins are for us. Our Christian establishment, that's why we're here. The rest of our Bethlehem day is on a separate video because I didn't have enough room for all the feasting and the dancing. You gotta see the dancing.